in order to avoid table errors in remediating your files and PDF through the accessibility checker. You want to look at some of your tables to see if they need headings or whether they could have headings. And in this case, I don't see any headings that could possibly work for these two tables. So what I would do is I would take the content of the table out of the PDF tags. And so I'm going to show you how to remediate that. I come over here to this arrow and I click on the tags. And that panel shows up. And I drop the tags down so I can find the tables. And here they are. Here's the first one. And here's the second one. The first table is structured with five rows and two cells in each row. So if I bring those up, you'll see exactly what it looks like in the structure. But it only needs the table structure visually. It doesn't need it in the PDF. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into each cell, find the content, in this case, responsible officer, and we're going to drag it up here and drop it under the last paragraph above the table. And then I'm going to do that to the second cell, Chief Information Officer. And I'm going to drag it up and drop it. And then once I'm done with that row, I click on the row and I use my delete key and delete it. Now I'm into the second row. I'm going to open up the data cells and again follow suit. And I'm going to continue to do this through the rest of this table. Now all the paragraphs are out of the data cells and I've deleted all the rows of the table. So if I click on the table, and it has to be blue, and then you can press delete, and you've removed the table structure from the PDF, but you've left the content of the table. And so there you have it. Now the content is all accessible, but the table is not going to go through the checker and be seen as a table any longer. Now the second table is a little different and that is because the table isn't made properly. So let's look at that table. And I'm going to drop this down and you're going to see it's one row with two cells and each of the cells has three lines. And so what it should have had, it should have had two columns and three rows. So what I'm going to do to fix this is to remove the structure out of the table by taking the first paragraph out of the first cell, dragging it up here, and then going to the second cell, the first line, and bringing that up. And then I'm going to do the middle of the first cell. And then I'm going to do the middle of the second cell. And then we get to the last row here, and we're going to take the first data cell and drag it up and the last data cell and drag that up. Then we can delete the row by pressing the delete key and then pressing delete again to delete that table. So all the content is now marked up properly so the accessibility checker will pass these tables without worry about headings. Thanks for watching and have a great day.